Welcome to the Lion Experience. I have two amazing women with me. I am Camille, your host, and I have Prophetess Bibles, my co-host. Y'all say what's up to my, to my co-host. What's going on? Yes. <laughs> and we also have a very special guest. Her name is Miss Audrey Hayes. We're going to talk about her all night. We're going to talk about her later and introduce her and give y'all all the lowdown on her. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So, how do y'all feel, ladies? Excited, excited. super excited. Excited to pumped be here. up. Y'all pumped up. It's super dope. Yes, it is. How was, how was y'all's day? How was work? My day was wonderful. Work was work, and it made the day go by really fast. So that was good. Okay, okay, cool. So, Miss Audrey, uh, what did you do today? Beauty yeah. shop all day. You went to the beauty shop all day. To all get ready? day, getting, <laughs> getting, ready getting ready for today. Ready. How you doing? Uh, well, yeah. All right, there. Getting Ready, ready. Okay, good. So I did the same. I worked. I went to the beauty shop too. I tried something new today. Okay. Um, because I wanted to look good like y'all. You know? uh, yes. and I'm well, glad, I'm glad that we are in alignment. Yes, we are. I'm glad that we are in alignment. <laughs> Not only are we y'all big, look beautiful nice. women, y'all look so nice. We yeah. are beautiful inside and out. Yes. Hello. Yes. You yes. better. I know I am. You better. Uh huh. Come on. All right. So, um, today our topic for today. And it was it was kind of wrapped around our special guest topic, and we're gonna talk about that later. But um, the topic is warning signs mm-hmm. and early detection. 
I know you can pull a good message out of that. Come property, on, you property, better. Property Bible. <laughs> you Matter better. Fact, I'm I, trying. To. I want to just. I'm a, can you introduce yourself? Yes, and I can. Tell us about you, please. Hello, 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 everyone. I'm Prophetess Bowers. I'm in the great city of Dallas. I'm yes. right in your city. Yes. I've been been here, born and raised here. Look, I'm excited about what God is doing. I say amen a lot, so let me just say that disclaimer. But if I could tell a little bit about me, just look at me, okay? okay. I'm a living, walking testimony. Yes. And I'm going to leave it at that. Praise the Lord. All right. <laughs> she got lit. <laughs> I'm, I'm ready. I'm ready. <laughs> she got lit, and I love it. I'm glad God brought her into my life um, yes. since day one, yes. since day moment, minute one. We yes. met at Lucy Blues in DeSoto. Come on, oh, Lucy. Come on, Boutique. I didn't yes. know it was plus size. Yes, oh, yeah. absolutely. She has some small sizes. She has some beautiful things in there. Okay. Yes. Mm -hmm. and I met this beautiful Shout out, Lucy there. Blue. We just shared a few words. And before you know it, I felt the Holy Spirit Ooh. come just beaming off of her. All right. And when two are aligned. Yes. And mm -hmm. when you yes. can feel your father coming off, that's your sister. Well, sister. you better come on. So that was about two years ago at the most. <laughs> yeah. And yeah. we tried to link up. We tried to link yes, up. Yes, we did. Things busy. Phone we tag. Busy. Phone tag. Mm -hmm. When I tell you. What's y'all link? We, 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 we locked in. That alignment. Okay. We locked in. It's we, the alignment. We, we church members now. <laughs> yes, we are. <laughs> Business partners. Yes, That's we my are. Oh, Elevation. Prayer partner. Elevation. Whatever. Elevation. If I need advice. Elevation. If I'm down, I pick up the phone. I think I'm finna say something about, something about being sad. Come she on. Is lifting me yes, up Lord. Okay. Come on. That's a plan. Let's, That's a plan. let's help. Let's That's help, plan. help each yes. other. My daily devotional yesterday mm -hmm. talked about how how Proverbs tells you a friend loves at all times. Ooh. Yes. Come on. Yes. That'll preach. That. So that'll preach all by yes. itself. Absolutely. Yes. Absolutely. It's important to have that. That's friendship. Yes. <laughs> That's sisterhood. Yes. Yes. <laughs> so, yes, like I said, we met, and it's just been on and popping, and I'm thankful for her. I'm thankful for Miss Audrey, too. Thank you. Ms. Absolutely. Audrey was referred to, be, to me by my grandma. Yes. Okay. Her yes. and my granny. Awesome. They, they, they type. Yes, God. They're tight. She, yes. she don't even like me to talk Sister about hood. my granny. She's quiet. When I get to talk about my granny, she be like, she be like, that's sister I'm hood. like, that's my granny. It's I all right. About it's all right. But at the same time, I'm glad that my granny has other strong women like me around her. Absolutely. To protect her when I'm not. It matters. Absolutely. Come on. I know it I'm matters. All time. I know. I feel it. Yes. I feel it. I can't even talk about my own friend. <laughs> but, you know, she ain't having it. She's not having it. And I'm, 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 I'm with it. So, um, <laughs> go ahead. Uh, let's just jump right into it. Um, we're on topic three. We did our introductions and all that good stuff. Before we do this, can you do you have any words of encouragement um, that you, you know, would like to share? You know, encouraging. You know, I always have something to say. I want to say this. It doesn't matter what it feels like. Sometimes we can be so emotional mm -hmm. about things. I had a testimony today. Where a bill came from down from six thousand to six hundred dollars, okay, and it wasn't Woo. it about it was you know the enemy had come, had come and tried to discourage and tried to put something there, but it was uh, all types of emotions that I haven't felt in a long time, and so I want to encourage somebody. Look here, it's not about how you feel about it. It's not about what you think about it. Yes. I stood on the word of God. Okay. I stood on his word. Yes. I prayed to the father and yes. he showed up. I encourage somebody today to step out on yes. faith. Be yes. encouraged. It's a lot going on, yes. man. You know, people losing their lives, yeah. losing their mind. It's, it's in the emotions of it all. But if we stand on the word of God, and if you don't know the word, it's okay. We're going to see to it that you get to it. Keep on watching us. We're going we gonna to push you <laughs> to the place of purpose. But I just encourage you to hold on and to trust in the word of God. That, that's all I have about that. That's okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And, and it sounds like she could have kept going. I, you, you heard the preacher rising in me, did I you? I did. I, I heard leave it. it alone. I, I, I know we weren't going to. We kind of went a little different. But do you have any encouragement, any encouraging words you can give to someone that may be down, Want to start a business? Don't know where to start. Want to start a nonprofit? Don't know where to mm -hmm, start. Mm -hmm. Have an issue? Somebody may be abused. Somebody may be mistreated. Mm -hmm. Do you have anything that you could say to me? Yes, I could. First of all, I want to say, give yourself grace. Ooh. 
Okay. Uh, uh, allow yourself to be imperfect. Okay. Okay. Although we strive each day to be perfect, mm -hmm. allow your imperfections to make you better. Yeah. Okay. Wow. You, use those as wow. encouragement. Use wow. that as a force to move you yes. along. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. And in that process, make sure you always give yourself grace. Ooh. Yes. I, I what is that grace? I'm just going to. Yeah. Go ahead. Can you tell? Can you the, tell us the, what grace is? The grace is forgiving yourself. Mm -hmm. Okay. 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 A, a lot of times, our own guilt holds us back and holds us stagnant. Absolutely. So first and foremost, forgive yourself. That's that self love that you have to. Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay. Come on. Then in that, you give grace to others. Yeah. You have to know that anybody else's perception is based on their reality. Mm -hmm. okay? okay? So you have to meet people where they are. Mm -hmm. So not only do you give yourself grace, you give other people grace as well. Baby, you wow. can... Are you, are you a motivational speaker? Wow. I'm working on it. To I, be wow. Honest. Well, baby, wow. we going to get some practice. Okay. Yes. <laughs> we gonna get some, I love this triple. I you better come it's on. It's not even a duo. This triple D threat. Oh, triple D. Come on. Threat. It's a triple Dallas threat I know here. that's right. I know that's right. So I can't let y'all give a word of encouragement yes. and I'm not give a word of come encouragement. Come on. Okay. Really I just want to tell you, don't quit. Ooh. Yeah. Whatever you do, you can't quit. Mm -hmm. If mm -hmm. you quit, you're lame. Mm -hmm. You're losing. Mm -hmm. You're beneath. Mm -hmm. I want to be the lender, not the borrower. So well, I do so not quit. Come on. I want to be above. I am above and not beneath. Well, and you are too. And it's whatever you tell yourself. Mm -hmm. It's what you do in the morning. Mm -hmm. What do you do in the morning? Do mm -hmm. you get up and pray? Mm -hmm. Do you get up and meditate? Do you get up and work out? <laughs> do you get up and eat something healthy? Help do us. Do you drink sis? water? Or you Help drink us. Sugar? What are you putting in your body first thing in the morning? Are you telling yourself affirmations? It matters. You have full control over your life. If mm -hmm. you're not where you want to be right now, it is nobody's fault but yours. I don't well, care what your mama did, what your again. dad did. You are grown. Mm -hmm. Dust yourself off. Mm -hmm. Get your butt get up. up. Uh -huh. Put on some deodorant. Come on. Take a bath first. Ooh. Put on some clothes, not just any clothes. <laughs> Dress for the occasion, as you can see. Yes. We all look good. Something that yes. makes you feel good. Thank That's you. it. Yes. That's Set it. your tone mm -hmm. and cut it out. That's it. And don't quit. Okay. That's I, it. That's my. That okay. was beautiful. I wanted to look at him. Come on, with the I eyes. I wanted to talk to him with the eyes. I said what I said. Mm -hmm. Don't quit. Mm -hmm. Don't quit. Don't quit. All right. That's good. So, thank That's you. Good. Thank you so much. That's good. I thank God for putting that in my spirit and to encourage other people because. We get down all the time. Yes. You know what I'm saying? We be in our head. Mm -hmm. We be thinking negative thoughts mm -hmm. and, we, and wondering why the world feel like it's coming tumbling down on us. Ooh. And, we, and you don't have to do that. Speak positive. Trust. Push yourself. Trust. Put some deodorant on. Trust. Yes. Put, put, put some clothes on. Put your nice earrings on. Get mm -hmm. your hair done. Don't be dusty. Yeah. Yeah. Don't be dusty and musty. Come on. <laughs> Ooh, you better come on. <laughs> Okay, I'm going to come down. You better come on. I'm going to come all the way down. <laughs> so we all three of Don't us be. are business women. Yes, we are. All yes. three of us are not just beautiful business women. We are beautiful business women that are out here making a change. Absolutely. Yes. We are making impact. 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 You better impact. be in alignment. Impact. You better be in alignment. The impact is real over here. Yes, it is. So I know we all have amazing lives, mm -hmm. but there comes time for change. Yes. And new things happen. Yes. Mm -hmm. So I want each of us to kind of just, we all are business owners. Tell about your business, what you do, your purpose, your gifts, but what's new in your life? Who Absolutely. Wants to go first? You go first, Prophet. Okay, okay. Well, listen, you know, all things new. One thing for me um, that I'm learning is how to build relationships. Okay. Yes. I'm learning how to step out on faith, yes. trust in God's word, mm -hmm. trust my instinct, and build those relationships. I think that's the biggest thing that's new for me. Um, when you mentioned the podcast, I, I jumped right in. Yes. Yes, sure did. Where is it at? What's the location? What time? <laughs> what time? I'm ready. Mm -hmm. Why? Because I'm in alignment. Yes. And I'm willing and I'm ready to build relationships. So that's what's new for me. Um, I'm a life and business coach. I have, I'm have. i a plethora entrepreneur. I have credit management that I do. Um, I'm in ministry. Mm -hmm. I have a 501c3 nonprofit that I'm running. Okay. Amen. God is just gearing. I'm a, um, I don't went, went uh, blind, uh, blind. I don't went blank a little bit, but I am a licensed um, insurance agent. 
I'm right. a claim adjuster. Everybody that. Hello, okay? I'm a claim adjuster. And so there's a plethora of things that I have going on. And I heard the Lord say to me in my time of prayer, and there go that alignment again. Okay. Build new relationships. Yes. You cannot do everything yourself. Yes. You can't. You at a, you know, sometimes we try to do everything and, and, and make sure everything. No, you have to build out. Great leaders know how to delegate. And so that's what I'm learning to do. And that's what's new for me right about now. That's why I'm here. Let's build. Okay. Let's build. I know you got something else. Because <laughs> I, know, I know your business a little Ooh. bit. So go ahead and tell us what's coming up. So I do have a women conference that's coming up. Yes, God, God has released that thing in the Dallas region, and uh, we are going to make impact for change. It's the I'm Coming Out Women Conference. Men can come, too. I'm not excluding men. Praise God. Men and children are welcome, and we're just wanting to apply impact for change. It starts at home. You know, sometimes we do a lot of complaining about yeah. what's going on in the city, but what are you doing? My auntie, uh, Sine Mary, says it all the time. Time. If you want to see the change, be, be the, the change. change. I've been in the city all my life. And so now it's time I've been working behind the scenes. But God, because of that alignment and because I'm obedient and willing to step out on faith and build relationships, he's bringing it to the forefront. Yes. Yeah. So it's a beautiful thing. And that's that's what's going on, what's new for me. What about you? <laughs> Well, I am a successful entrepreneur of 13 years. I, You name it, I've done it. Okay. okay. Well, what I on. have been most successful at is running a 501c3. Okay. Uh, we're a nonprofit organization that works with summer camps and at risk What's after school. It? It's called Unique Pieces Incorporated. Okay. We're based out of DeSoto. Like that. Okay. We work with summer camps and after school programs, providing them with free lunch, a free okay. snack for their camp. Okay. Um, what's new for me is I am in the making of becoming a motivational speaker. Oh, All right. right. Oh, Come on. To use my testimony <laughs> Come on. to move, motivate, and inspire women. Mm -hmm. I want to be a voice for women. Oh, okay. I, I, I want to use the experience. Everything you go through in life, mm -hmm. God wants you to use it. Absolutely. And, and it's meant not just for you. It's meant to help someone else. Absolutely. So I'm going to take my testimony and help move women Ooh, forward. Come on. Come on. Yes. Not that about us. Goal. That is what I'm working on right now. That's it. What about you, Camille? <laughs> With the shoulder. That was amazing. With the, yeah. I'm, I'm, still stuck. I'm still stuck at the speaker. Yes. You be a I want to be a motivational Why do you speaker. you want to be a motivational speaker? Tell us. Um, I say all the time, God has given me the gift of gab. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. Um, I, I, a lot of times when you meet people, it's very easy to determine what's different between you two. Mm -hmm. But what I like to do is find what I have in common. Okay. And I can find something in common with anyone, a homeless person, mm -hmm. a millionaire, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. Because we're all human. Either we're, we're women, we're mothers, we're daughters, yes, we're sisters, yes. we're cousins, yes. we're business owners, yes. we're friends. We can always find something in common. Mm -hmm. So I want to use what I have in common with people to help them grow. Absolutely. Yes. Wow. That yes. is wow. so good. That's amazing. It is. That's amazing. I'm, honored. I'm like, I didn't know all this. I mean, I knew you were a beautiful woman. Yeah. I know you had purpose. Inside I know my granny sent you yes. there for a reason. But I'm I'm not saying it's because the camera's are rolling. Mm -hmm. Like this vibe that I feel, mm -hmm. this is not the end. Yes. Okay. This is not a one time thing. Yes. Oh, I'm excited about it. Are you so excited about that? I am. When, when you invited me to be on your podcast, I was super excited. I was like, this is a, a step in that That's direction. It. That's it. it. It's moving me towards my oh, goal. Man. I don't I, have no tissue up here. <laughs> Listen, I'm going to have to step to the side. Don't grab you do it. Don't, don't do it. I, don't go, do it. I use my sleeve. I have to go But there. I appreciate that. Because yes. that's something that I, she's already a prophet. She has, it's in her gift. Ooh. But as for me, Ooh. I desire to be a speaker too. Come okay. on. And I didn't know that I desired that. Mm -hmm. Okay. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. I was actually prophesied by that lady over there to your right. <laughs> she told me, you know, some things that God told her yeah, that I already kind of believe. I have already believed because I've been prophesied to before. Yeah, okay. And I know mm -hmm. that I have that gift of gab too. Mm -hmm. okay. I don't need a stranger. Come on. And me you know, either. I'm comfortable and people are comfortable with me. So mm -hmm. I do like to help all the time. Beautiful. Especially with my words That's too. Beautiful. Just lift up and encourage people. Mm -hmm. So I think birds of a feather would flock together. Here we are. All right, y'all. Right, so I'm Millie. I'm Millie, Millie, Millie's one stop shop. 
If you follow me, if you know me, <laughs> you know I'm a half Jamaican and I do everything. Come on. You know what I'm half Jamaican. Come on. <laughs> and I'm a photographer first. That was my first business. I mm -hmm. started making T-shirts because I want to... I wanted to market my business. So I started making T-shirts. T-shirts started booming even faster, more faster than, than the photography did. Mm -hmm. um, I, when COVID hit, I started this podcast. So that's, that, that's amazing. I started this podcast. In the pandemic. In the pandemic. In the pandemic. In the pandemic. And so um, I also started selling health and wellness products um, with Total Life Changes. So I am a distributor. So I did lose 60 pounds on the Delgada Coffee. Shout out to Jack and John. The All right. CEO, the Total Life Changes. Yes. Thank you for your TLC yes. sisters. And yes, she's a TLC yeah. rep as well. Okay. <laughs> so, and yes, we are plus size, but we do take our products. We, we sure work do. Out, and we yes. are beautiful. As and they you can work. See, we do like to indulge. We're going to go grab us a piece of chicken after this. Come but on. Don't worry about it. Lou beats the big Zach. Oh, Lou ain't. Well, so, so let me stay focused. Let me stay focused. So, um, yes, I also started a transportation business where I do transport celebrities, your grandma, your aunt, your cousin coming mm -hmm. in town for Thanksgiving or Christmas. I will pick them up from the airport and I will take them home. Come if y'all want to go out, I'll Safely. take y'all to Perry Safely. Out. Wherever y'all want to go, and we'll put on the vibe. Safely. So th that is another stream. And that's about it. But like we stated earlier, I do want to become a motivational speaker. Um, something new, I guess this relaunch today is Whoa, something hey, new. Woo, 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 the Lion woo. Experience, bringing that back. Um, come on, come on. What's new? I mean, you're my new business partner. Come we have on. a lot yes, that we we're do. trying to do. We a wanna, lot in common. Can I, get, can I give just a little bit of all oh, this? Yes. Just a little just bit? Just a smee. Okay, we want to do something for the mothers. <laughs> okay. So we're going to have an event for the mothers. I'm going to tell you everything. Um, we have our conference coming up. Um, we just got a lot. You know, we, do. we, got, we got a lot coming up for the year 2023. Absolutely. Um, God is good. Get I'm ready. thankful. So just get, get ready. ready. That's me. That's who I am. Um, get ready. And I just thank y'all again for being here. I feel yes. so good. Yes. That yes. was beautiful. That was I would, beautiful. I would love to speak at your at oh. your conference. All right, oh, now. Yes. Well, come on. Yes. Just put in an yes. application. I, I love it. Baby, hire, hire me now. I love it. Hire me now. <laughs> Yes. I do love it. MC? We will definitely. Do we need do, somebody to host? Do. Oh, I can handle that. Amen. We're going to definitely that. talk after this. Okay. okay. See, the mm -hmm. connection. You see? The in, a, in, alignment. in alignment. In alignment. Yes. Oh, my God. Oh, wow. Okay. So, let's let's keep wow. it pushing. Um, wow. Wow. We wow. have wow. about a good, a little bit less than 30 minutes. We want to go ahead and give our guest speaker respect and her yes. due diligence. I do want to introduce her to Thank you guys. You. Thank you. Um, Audrey Hayes is a successful business owner. Yes. She owns the nonprofit Unique Pieces Incorporated. Mm -hmm. She has 13 years of experience as a business owner. Yes. She has helped over 20 successful businesses grow. Can we clap right there? I just want to. 20 successful businesses Come grow. Come on. She has managed to grow both the nonprofit mm -hmm. and profit 20% every year, even mm -hmm. in the pandemic. Come yes. on. Yes, yes, yes. She is a leader of the community. She serves the community yes. by feeding summer camps and after school programs Food for free. She feeds my son. Listen. I came to find out that she was feeding my baby all And didn't food. even know it. And didn't even and know it. And didn't even know it. Yeah. Didn't even know it. <laughs> That's all right. Okay. <laughs> to date, she has served over 500,000 500, meals in over 50 locations within That's the last huge. 10 years. That is huge. Food is essential. Okay? Yes, it this is. This is in addition to managing over a million dollars in federal that's yeah. huge. That is huge. I'm rubbing elbows. I'm rubbing back. I'm rubbing back. Okay. And she. Oh, this is this is the reason why That's we're amazing. here. That's amazing. Last but not least, she happens to be a breast right. cancer survivor. Woo! So her story <laughs> yielded us to our topic, which is warning yes, signs yes. and early detection. So, Miss Hayes, you have the floor. She's going to tell us how Amazing. she mm. detected breast cancer early. Amazing. Okay, so let's talk about it. Okay. Um, I turned 40 in February of 2021. Okay. 
And I went and got a mammogram, like they say you should, mm-hmm. at 40. Mm-hmm. Uh, three weeks later, I got a call from the doctor saying they found a lung. Mm-hmm. She wanted to schedule me for a biopsy. Okay. Uh, the first biopsy came back negative, but my doctor, being thorough and who she was, knew that we should do some additional testing. Mm-hmm. So she sent me for an MRI, and she scheduled me for another biopsy. And in September of 2021, it came back that I had stage zero cancer. Mm -hmm. Now, I'm going to pause there for a minute. Wow. Because most people do not know that stage zero cancer exists. Mm. It is the earliest stages of breast cancer. Mm -hmm. It means that it's still contained within your milk ducts. Mm-hmm. And it has not spread to other tissue. Wow. So I am a living testimony wow. to how Ooh. early detection can save your life. My God. When my doctor told me I had stage zero cancer, she also said it's 100% curable. My so God. I knew that there was nothing but victory Jesus. on the other side mm-hmm. of this storm. Mm-hmm. Okay. Mm-hmm. So what happens after you're diagnosed with breast cancer? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. You will go through a series of tests to prepare you for surgery. Okay. Okay. I had what is called a lumpectomy, which is where they remove the cancer or abnormal tissue. Okay. For some women, they choose to have a mastectomy, which is where both breasts Mm -hmm. are removed. Okay. Now, if you choose to have both breasts removed, you can can have reconstructive surgery. Mm -hmm. We know that breasts make a woman feel like a woman, Mm -hmm. so that's always still an option. So I had the first surgery in October, Mm -hmm. and um, they do what they call testing the margins, which means Mm -hmm. they take out a, a certain size mass, and then they test the perimeter of it mm-hmm. to see if it's negative for cancer. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Well, when they tested my margins, they were still positive. Wow. So I had to have a second surgery mm-hmm. in November, okay? okay? Second surgery came back. The margins were clear. It meant that all the cancer had been removed. Mm-hmm. Now, after you have surgery, it takes about six to eight weeks to heal from surgery. And I was scheduled to do radiation, Okay. Mm-hmm. In radiation, that it's really called fractions, which are small doses of, uh, uh, what is the word I'm looking for? Small uh, doses of radiation mm-hmm. okay. distributed over time. Mm-hmm. I mm-hmm. had 33 fractions. Mm-hmm. Okay. Mm-hmm. In this process, I'm going to tell y'all, every week you see the doctor, right? Mm-hmm. And he asks you how you doing and how you feeling. And mm-hmm. every week I will be like, I'm okay. Mm-hmm. I'm good. I'm fine. Mm -hmm. He was like, well, how's your skin? I'm okay. I'm good. I'm fine. Mm -hmm. Well, it wasn't until my, the day before my last radiation session Mm -hmm. that I realized why he kept looking at me like I was a walking miracle. Mm -hmm. Okay. Because your skin will burn from the radiation Mm -hmm. and it peels. Okay. I did not begin to peel until the day before my last session. Wow. Now, when I Googled what my skin was supposed to look like versus what it looked like, I couldn't do anything but give praise. All right, now. Because God showed me favor throughout this entire process. Wow. Okay. So, on April 25th, 2022, Mm -hmm. I was officially cancer-free. Praise God. Congratulations. Praise God. Praise God. Praise God. Praise God. Yes. Beautiful, beautiful. Yes. Beautiful. Yes. I Congratulations. Thank you. So I know a mm. lot of people, that's rare mm. to get. We, I've never heard of stage zero. Most mm-hmm. people haven't. Mm-hmm. Yes. So, so, so I've lost someone. My teacher passed away while in school. Uh, not in school, but while I was in school, my teacher passed away. She lost her breath. They, they took them, but she still passed away. Okay. Mm-hmm. So what would you say to someone that, is experiencing going through through those doctor meetings, going through radiation. Mm-hmm. Their skin is not looking as good as yours look. Right. You know, they don't have that same testimony. What can you say to them to encourage them where they are? Okay. What what I would say kind of comes back to what I said earlier. Okay. Mm. First, give yourself grace. Okay. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. A, a, allow yourself to trust the process. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay. Uh, I have been to over 60 doctor's appointments. Okay. So there are going to be a lot of going and coming, a lot of going and coming, and it does wear you down. You you get tired of going to the doctor, but you have to know and you have to, first you have to speak healing in your life. Mm. 
each and every day. That affirmations you were talking about, that is a serious thing, okay? You have to wake up every day and declare health. You have to declare victory. You have to declare well-being, okay? And after you speak over yourself, trust the process. Mm -hmm. Trust that God has sent you the doctor's who will provide you the very best care. Yes. And in that process, you will get tired, but you have to know that, again, there is victory mm-hmm. on the other side. Absolutely. So for anyone who is experienced seeing either having a mammogram that you're waiting on the results mm-hmm. for, or you've gotten the results and they came back positive, you have to trust and believe that our Father God that we serve yes. is a healing God. Yes, Lord. He is an almighty God. Yes. And there is nothing that with his glory and his wow. grace that we cannot <laughs> overcome and surpass. Okay. Ooh. So I would encourage you to stay faithful. Mm. I would encourage you to stay consistent. Change your eating habits. Change yeah. your working out habits. Change mm. your day-to-day habits. Mm-hmm. Do what you need to do in order for you to be healthy, healthy again. Mm-hmm. Yes. yes. Mm-hmm. I love that. Grace. Uh, Prophetess Bibles, do you have anything to say about that testimony? Ooh, I'm stirred up. <laughs> I'm trying not to shout right now. <laughs> I feel it in my bones, and I'm going to leave that alone. But I tell you, I, 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 I'm, I'm amazed. I'm amazed. Um Congratulations Thank uh, you. to you. And I'm just empowered. I'm uplifted by that. I didn't know a zero existed uh, when it comes to cancer's di- diagnosis. And so, yeah, this is amazing. I, I, I'm i elevated. How about that? Yes, I, I'm I, elevated. I, I am too. Um, I don't know if y'all are live. Um, engineer, I am. do you see any mm-hmm. questions? Are there any questions? How many viewers do we have on Duncanville Studios? No questions. Do okay. we have any views? How many views we got? Yeah. Two right now. How y'all okay. doing? Welcome. Hey, hey, so, hey. Um, <laughs> we do want to give some shout outs. Um, your organization is called Strong, excuse Sis- me, Sisters United mm-hmm. Strong Hands Incorporated. Yes. We want to give y'all a shout out. All you right. Know, <laughs> special thanks just because. Even today, like your Thank organization you. really brought me a lot of joy <laughs> Thank today. You. We're gonna be having photo shoots and headshots Woo-woo. tomorrow. Yes. We got a few books tomorrow. So okay. if you wanna come back tomorrow, do you have time? You can come back and get your little yes, headshot. I, I know you made okay. up right now. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> do it again. Okay, you can do it. We can do it's it. No problem. She can do it again. You can come back Just go tomorrow. to sleep, wake we'll up and do it again. <laughs> I do want to give Sisters United Strong Hands Thank a, a you. huge shout out. Thank we you. want to give a shout out to Duncanville Studios. We yes. can rush for allowing us Woo. to be here on his podcast. <laughs> we thank him for his engineer. Absolutely. An area, a location for us to do our thing. This is beautiful. Yes. And this then we want to give a shout out to Unique Pieces Incorporated as well. All right. Thank you, yes. for, thank you for feeding yes. my baby. Yes. yes. And, and thank you for, I'm thank, thanking you on behalf of those people you got the grants for. All right. Okay. Now. <laughs> you want rugs? I, 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 I smell again. a grant we go, coming on. We going to talk after and that's this. A t-shirt. Yes, it I is. Smell I grant. smell a grant. <laughs> yes. Oh, no. So we want to give everybody a shout out. We want to thank Beautiful. our viewers. We thank, <laughs> thank y'all for you. coming on. Thank you so much. Um, we do. We will have this podcast twice a month. Woo! Our next show, though. Elevation. Our next segment. Y'all, Elevation. you might as well just come on back. Y'all. Elevation. You, might, you, might, you might as well just come on back. Might as well just, just come back. <laughs> because our next show will be a segment that will help all business owners. Okay. We're giving out tips about stable, uh, stabilizing and updating your business. And it will be That's shared... Good. From top millionaires. Like, I got these tips. I got millionaires Come on. that are giving tips. Um, Come and on. you don't want to miss it. Uh, Come like, on. We all have been let down. We've all wanted to give up. We've all not put our best foot yes. forward yes. in our business. Yes. So the next podcast is we get into the money. Yeah. We get into the business. Well, the money is Oh, that's my area of expertise, getting Come to the on. money. Come on. You okay. better you say that. that. <laughs> that's my area of expertise. Mind you. <laughs> get into, let me say it one more time. That's my area of expertise Come when it comes to getting to that money. Okay. You want to talk about getting the bag? Oh, I'm there for Come it. Come on. Okay. I'm down for that. I like the way that sounds. Absolutely. I like the way that Listen, sounds. Listen, it works so, for me. I truly thank you all for joining in. Do y'all have any last words? Does, does anybody on live have any questions for us? Anybody, y'all have anything? Else I want to mind? say, uh, I just want to uh, thank all the viewers here. Um, I'm elated to, to be in this space. 
Stay tuned. Y'all, we have some wonderful things that are coming up. We're going to elevate. We're going to empower. We're going to talk about the money. We're talking about all things new. Don't be afraid to comment because we want to read your comments. We want to know how you feel. How are we doing? Um, I want to say we'll be able to give you some information on how to contact us oh, yeah, um, as well. Great. Okay. So if you want to contact us, contact us on our social media. My social media is C A M. I L L E Camille Henderson mm-hmm. on Facebook. My number is 214-502-2918. I'm on IG as Millie M I L L I E, the photographer. <laughs> okay. You can find me on Facebook underneath Audrey Hayes. You can find me on IG under AK Girl Boss. Mm. And you can contact my nonprofit Unique Pieces for information about how to work with your organization at 214-664-2486. Amazing. Thank you, ladies. And so you can contact me at Evangelist Bold and Beautiful Bibles. I am on Facebook. I would love to be your friend. Send me a friend request. Send me a direct message. I will answer. I promise I'm getting better with building relationships. So I'm on the lookout for the next best thing. And also you can catch me on IG, Coach Bree 777 um, If you want to email me about the nonprofit, anything dealing with nonprofit, networking, building relationships, coaching, you can reach me at Sisters United Strong Hands, Inc. Sisters United Strong Hands, I-N-C at gmail.com. Thank you all. all let, right. let me Go just ahead. say for, for mom and ladies, it has been a pleasure Aww. to be here with you today. The energy in the <laughs> room is, is magnetic. <laughs> yes. Okay. It is. Um, it's amazing. For, for inviting me on to share my testimony. Absolutely. Thank you for helping me to walk in the lane of being a motivational yes. speaker. Ooh. And I want to say I look I forward it. to being back here with you ladies. Of Very course. Soon. Of course. Yes. How can we say no? We yes. can't say no. <laughs> All right. Thank y'all so much for tuning in. This is the Lion Experience. A yes. new thing. Here. Yes. There is nothing on off limits. Nothing is off limits. Not We're a here thing. to talk about whatever. If you have a business, if you want to advertise your business, if yes. you want to come on our show, yes. if you want to exercise your skills, and you want to just be in the vibe with us, yes. please reach out to us. You know where I'm at. You know my number. You know my Facebook. If yes. not, hit up Duncanville Studio. They'll be able to tell you how to get in contact with me. Absolutely. Thank you for tuning in. Come back and see us. And it is a wrap. All right. All right.